this is what 475,000 in Melbourne for to get you. Nice two car garage. Beautiful neighborhood. This is coming in through the garage. You have washer and dryer. Easy access. Then straight through. Just around the corner here is the front door. Nice little pathway. table for the open house, living room, windows, ceiling fan, through the front door here. You have your living space, and then off to the left, I'm going to show you, is two of the three bedrooms and the kitchen. You run into the kitchen first. And the kitchen is open to this room. Then over to the left here is where we have two of the three bedrooms and splitting the bedrooms is the bath one of the bathrooms and here's the bedroom the ceiling fan overlooks oops, overlooks the backyard Sorry, knocked over one of the smell goods. But this is the closet now. There's that bathroom that splits the two rooms. Down the hallway, you got another little closet here. Got your ceiling fans. Something I'd like to point out about this house that I recognize, not that other houses don't, but something that I look for, here's a closet. Something that I look for, is outlets. Making sure you got lots and lots of outlets. Okay. There's that hallway again. So the bedroom there, bathroom, bedroom. And then when you come out of here, it's into your open kitchen, into this area. From this area here, it's open to the Florida room. Now this Florida room has, it's a screened in back porch, but these are not windows. These are screens with protective screens. So there's an outer screen and a screen. But it's actually raining right now and it is not wet in here. So maybe if it was like a heavy rain. And you do have a little bit of the view 
of the pond over here. And we just had a gentleman and his wife talk about they would love to put a pool in right here. Screened in pool if they were to buy it. And I thought that would be a great idea because these guys behind have a screened in pool over there as well. And then this door here actually leads, it's access to the main master bedroom, but it's off of the bathroom. So through the bathroom, you have access to the hoarder room, which I will show you that room now. As we navigate back to the house. Again, this is the room that overlooks the kitchen that's wide open. And this is the front room area. So there's the front room area from the main entrance. And then you got this long space here. It looks like they might have done a table here at some point, whether they use like a dining room here or maybe this is another entertainment area and maybe that was a dining place. I don't know, but there's a lot of options for both of them. Very useful space. Now, here is the room, the bastard. When you walk in, you got the double open doors and this room is huge. I don't know if my camera actually does it any justice, but it's a really big room. And then there's the ceiling. But this is the bath, the, the master bath. It's got the his and hers sinks, the full length mirror, walk in shower, walk in closet. Had a lot of Husbands bring their wives today and they love this part, the walk-in closet. Big shower. You fit more than, more people in here than you need to, but that's how big it is. Nice little bathtub. And then you got your bath with the sink, another sink next to your toilet. And here's that door for access. To the Florida room.